commandment to man saying, of every tree in the garden you may freely, but you may freely partake of everything. But, but, the tree of knowledge of good and evil, I'm asking you to stay away from it. Leave it alone. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And after he gave the command, God said to himself again, but after a while, God said, it, it is good for man not to be alone. I think Adam was, you know, con contemplating in his mind. I feel lonely. I need somebody to talk to at night and talk to when I'm alone. So God heard it. You know, they could talk in our mind sometimes. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And the Bible said that God caused Adam to be in a deep sleep and he took one of his ribs and formed woman. And took the woman to Adam. The woman to Adam. And Adam called for Eve. And the Bible says that the, the serpent is a cunning, very cunning. And the woman repeat to the when the serpent came, oh bless the name of Jesus, the woman repeat to the serpent that if we eat of that tree, we shall surely die. But the woman, but the serpent rather, which is cunning, trick the woman telling her and putting her state of mind somewhere else and say, if you eat, you shall not die. But be like God. Be like you shall not die, but be like God. A different frame of mind you, he put her into. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And it will make you wise. So she took the fruit and she ate and then she took it to her husband and her husband ate. Oh bless the name of Jesus. Oh bless the name of Jesus. Oh bless the name of Jesus. And the scripture said that their eyes were open immediately and saw that they were naked. Oh bless the name of Jesus. But I want you to understand tonight that they sin not because of the fruit but because of disobedience. Yes. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And they come to a point in the Bible that the Bible says that God came down in the cool of the evening. Yes. Huh. When it's very nice and you think that the day is done. Yes. And you're going to go to bed now and relax for tomorrow. Yes. And the Bible said that God cried out, Adam, where? Are done. And God start to interrogate them. Oh bless the name of Jesus. 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 And the Bible said, Adam, why are you hiding? When I left here, you, you didn't know that you were naked. So why are you here? Why are you hiding now? Oh bless the name of Jesus. Something is wrong. Yes, oh, bless the name of Jesus. Did you do the very thing I say you are not to do? Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. And, 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 and Adam was in a state of mind wondering what to say to God. But he remembered in his mind that God gave him a woman. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And he said, God, it's the woman you give unto me. <laughs> oh, Jesus, bring the fruit to me and I partake of it. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But Adam was so blind and didn't realize that he was the one that God left in charge. Give dominion and to rule. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. He started the, the blame game and said, God, it's the woman you 
deliverance for me. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And I want to take a key note of Genesis 1 and 26 from the Amplified Virgin. Amplified Virgin. He said, Then God said, Let us make man in our own image according to our likeness. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Not physique, but spiritual personality and moral likeness. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And let them have complete authority over the fishes of the sea, the birds of the air, cattle, and over the entire earth. And over everything that creeps and crawls on the earth. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Adam was created first. And when I did deeper studies, the, the Hebrew name for Adam is man. The Hebrew name for Adam is man. Man claim thy position. And God made man to have dominion and rulership. It's going to sound away about man. <laughs> I'm going for the Bible way. Yes. Don't feel the way, ladies. It's how it's the Bible put it. Not to. Don't blame it. Blame the, blame the Bible. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So tonight, I want to... It's a very broad heading. So I don't want to go all over the place. So I want to stick to this part. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Which says, man claim... I read word a little bit of your, your team, my bishop. Don't you know chastise me for that. Point. That's all right. So my team tonight, from the original team, is man claim and maintain thy position in the church. I want to I want to stay in the church. I don't want to go out. Oh, it's too broad to go everywhere. So I want to stay in the church. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Man, claim thy position. No, I want to rephrase. Man, claim and maintain thy position in the church. In the church. Don't just claim it, but maintain it. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And I understand that in today's society they redefine what is man and I'm going to do a little demonstration in today's society don't get me wrong I don't do this if you don't have this in your mouth you're not considered a man You have to catch it here, and then you have the juice on the side. <laughs> the syrup. And then, if you're not walking with this, I want to talk to you, girl. I want to talk to, the, want to the ladies to accompany us. Come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, I need a go. I need a go. I need another go. Come on, somebody. I need another go. Come on. So, in today's society, if you're not smoking, you're not a man. And if you're not drinking, you're not a man. And if you're not walking and bouncing, with your two female friends beside of you? All right. You're not, you're not a man. You're not a man. Well. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So everywhere the man go, the woman they will have to go, and the poor will have to go. Because this is the source of strength. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And society redefine what is man. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And if you're not busting a gun, you are not a man. Yeah. Oh, but if you don't have the, the punch or the, the cigarette in your mouth, you are not a man. And if you're not drinking, you are not a man. 
Oh God, I have on the road so I can't do the rest. And if you're not swagging and having your pants down here, you are not considered a man. Oh, bless the name of Jesus, brother. Oh, bless the name of Jesus, brother. The Bible told me that he put man in position. Oh, bless the name of the rule and have dominion. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And he said in the book of Ephesians chapter 4, and he said some apostles, I want to stay in the church, brother. And he said some prophets. Can I hear the church tonight? Can I hear the church tonight? And he sent some evangelists, pastors, and preachers. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So the ministry can continue and for the edifying of the word of God. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Can I have a church in the house? Come on, be bless the name of Jesus. And I understand the, the problem we are having, especially us. Males, we are weak to the flesh. One of our greatest weakness, we are weak to the flesh. Let me take my turn. They won't. And not because they have long, flushy hairs. Looks good. And somebody says shaped like a guitar. <laughs> I would say have the Coca-Cola shape. The Coca-Cola shape. And when you know when females go in the mirror, they put themselves good. So some do it so they can woo you. <laughs> From the first, as you look at them, you go, whoa. Whoa. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But I understand that one of men's greatest weakness is the flesh. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And not because they have a hair, a long hair, and, 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 beaut and a beautiful face, and, and they shape good, and, and, and whatever we want to say. Not because of that. Not because they, they, they say they, they, they are the helper. That doesn't mean or give us the authority that everyone pass, we must be a part of them. <laughs> that doesn't mean we must take a slice of everyone that passes. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. And the only problem is that everybody pass. We must take a pie, a slice of the key. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But I want to remind you that you were, we were given the mandate to who? Have dominion. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. And the Bible told me that it's better to serve him single. You serve him better single. Oh, many don't like that, but that's how you go. You serve him better single. But the Bible said, if your body burn. Hi, 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 hi. He said, if your body burn, if you have the desire, he said, go and get married. Come on, can I hear the church? Can I hear the church? If your body a burn, if you desire, go and get married. And the Bible said, if you desire the position, and if you desire the office, you got to be blameless. Hey, 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 husband of one wife, hey, hey, hey. when that can rule well, maintain that position. Yes, man. You desire the position, you desire a good work, you desire the office, you desire a good work. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. 
Come on, be blessed the name of Jesus. And so many times men are put in position, but because we can't put ourselves on the submission, we let the flesh fall us and we let the flesh fall us. But the Bible tells me that we can't store. Put ourselves on the submission. We say we got to present ourselves as a living sacrifice. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. We got to put this body on the fasting and prayer. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. You want to rule well for you to go higher. You got to go lower. That means you need fasting and you need prayer. We let the flesh intimidate us. I can't come and tell about Paul and, and Abraham and this and that and really. And everybody. What about ourselves? What about us? And the thing that is happening in the churches today, we don't preach one on one message. That is affecting our everyday life. We can't. We just tell that Paul said that Abraham said that Moses said that and Peter said. But you can't tell nobody the correct thing what to do and what is happening right now. Man claim that position. We oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. We then lose our position. And then we start to do the blame game. We put in position, and because we can't control ourselves, we then lose our position. And then we start the blame game. God is the eye you gave the good turn to me. You gave me the eye to see. You gave me the desire. You gave me the heart and you gave me the mind. Yes. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But nobody blaming themselves. Oh, God, we always have a time to blame everybody else, but we can't see ourselves. We can't look in the mirror and judge ourselves. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And it's full time meals, and the men stop doing the blame game and set up ourselves. Oh, bless the name of Jesus because you were put in position to rule and have dominion. Stop the blame game. The Bible says that let not sin have dominion over your mortal body. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And right now, the Bible says that the harvest is ripe and the laborers are few. No, no, I want to tell you that the laborers are few in men. We always shall fall of man. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. The harvest is ripe and plenty with female. The harvest is ripe and less male in the church. Church tonight. Come on, somebody shout hallelujah. Come on, shout hallelujah. If you join the choir, that don't define you that you are nobody. Stop let society paint a picture. We want so many in Zion that can join the choir and sing some song up in here. We need some meal to join the deacon board. Talking to me tonight. The church is not talking to me tonight. We need some if 
your pastors in the house. Oh God, to shepherd your flock. Oh God, we need some bishops in the house to oversee the place. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. I want to ask the question. Men in Zion, where are they? Stop hiding. Society define you. If you join the choir, they label you as something else. But you're a sissy. You're a girl. And God bless you with the talent to sing. Yes, go ahead. And because we're listening to society and what society says. Oh God, and you go by the byways and edges. And if you go away on the road and see a church, you see the females at the front and the males at the back. Hiding. Hiding. Men is always hiding. I understand why. Why men is always hiding. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Zion is calling for the men of Zion. Hi, too long now we are hiding. Hiding ourselves from the position in which God has put us. And he said, send some in the church. Apostles. Yes. Prophets. Yes. Evangelists. Yes. Teachers. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. For the edifying of the word and the body of Christ. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. So there is work in the vineyard to do yes. but the male laborers are few and that is the problem yes. men fail to step up to their position <coughs> because they always find time doing something else and listening to what society is saying. We get so distracted of what society will call us. Because as I said before, some persons don't see themselves as a man if they are not in a gang. And if they are not having a gun, they are not a man. And if they are not smoking, they are not a man. And if they don't have five females, they are not a man. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. And we are, we, 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 we are, we, we are defeating the whole purpose of God. That we were put in position to rule and have dominion. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. Come on, we bless the name of Jesus. And another problem I found that, and Paul put it in this way, in a nutshell. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. He said, this I know also, that in the last days, perilous time shall come. For men shall be lovers of themselves. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Covetous and boasters. Can I have the church to worship? Proud and blasphemers. Disobedient to the parents. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. 
Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Life unto Paul. Oh, unto life unto Saul. When God sent Samuel to anoint Saul as king. And Samuel saw believing himself that he has arrived and don't need to listen to God anymore. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But you don't understand that is the same God that put you up. It's the same God that can take you down. So when you are put in position, stop moving off. You save like it's you put yourself there. But humble yourself under the mighty hands of God. Stop being lovers of yourself. Stop being up yourself. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But the Bible tells me, how can who can enter the kingdom of God? And the Bible tells me that God put a little child in the middle of in the, in the middle of the crowd because everybody was quarreling and contemplating who is the greatest. And God used a little child and let them know.
Oh Jesus, for his accusers, oh God, despisers of those that are good, become traitors and high-minded lovers of pleasures more than God's love. Yes. Having ungodliness and denying the power thereof from such and turn away. And I have, and I see another reason why men fail to claim their position. Claim and maintain their position. I didn't want to touch it, but I want to touch a little part of it. I didn't want to. But why many men can't claim their position, they can't make up their mind who they are or who they want to be. Some want to be a female in the night and some want to be a male in the day. In Jamaica, they will say, they on the borderline. <laughs> they on the borderline. They can't claim their position because they don't know who they want to be, if they want to be a man or they want to be a woman. So at night, they're a female, and daybreak, they're a male. Which one are you? So it's hard for them to claim their position because they don't know who they are. Is there a man or there a woman? Oh, bless the name of Jesus. But you can't be an unwavering spirit like the sea. Today we are one mind and tomorrow we have another mind. And today we have one personality and tomorrow we have another person.